there is there's lots of different things. I mean, I always have you know uh, my email, and and people can actually contact me directly from you know from my from my show, you know from any particular episode. Have a question, click here and and, and be able to contact me. So that that works really well, but it depends. Are you, you know, are you, or are your audience a Facebook people or are you linked, are you LinkedIn people or, you know, um, I don't think that Instagram is the right channel for this. Uh, but I think that either Facebook or LinkedIn are quite good and you don't even need to have a group. You could even have a, a business page, you know, that I have one called podcast host for hire that I post all of my episodes on every single week my episode gets gets posted there and week after week after week people comment on it you know and i and i post it on my per, on my personal linkedin and i post it on my on my business uh, on the business page for linkedin and i get different people that comment on each and give me different things and even if it's just five or six comments on a weekly basis over a year that's a lot of information you know, so it doesn't have to be this, you know, uh, big data set that you're sitting there analyzing on a, on a weekly basis. It can be the anecdotal information of say, hey, listen, we put out this podcast. What do you think? You know, what what did you take away from this? You know, what you know, we're 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 planning the next quarter's worth of uh, of episodes. Is there a guest that you'd really like to see, or is there a topic you'd really like us to cover? And putting it out either as a poll, putting it out as a poll, saying, "Listen, we want, you know, we want to have this, this, or this. Which one is is more important to you?" Um, and and just having those little different ways to engage, and it doesn't have to be over overly complicated or you know or you know, take you hours and hours and hours to dissect. It's a matter of anecdotally going out to your audience, letting them participate in a way that's comfortable for them. You know, and for me, it's LinkedIn because I'm not really a big Facebook person, but for other people, Facebook works way better. It just happens that, you know, 98% of my audience happens to be on LinkedIn. 